We got our cones laid out. We got Chris mixing up the chem. He's gonna fill up two buckets of SH, straight SH, 12.5. Uh, we're going straight because it's still kind of cold. It's 45 degrees and that chem's been sitting a while. So we go straight chem a lot when we're downstreaming. When you downstream it, it gets diluted obviously because it'll pull this and mix it with the water. Um, we got this little trailer here. It's a double wide, but it's short. And uh, getting ready to go on the market. This is a realtor we work with. Realtors can be your best friends. Um, but don't let them push you around too much on price unless they really bring you a lot of work, I guess. Um, so we're gonna work with what we got. So since this is a trailer in the middle of winter, it's winterized, which means you can't use the water. So we had to bring a full tank of water, which should be enough. Um, should be enough to uh, get the job done. All right, so far I've walked all the way around the house, trailer to the front and then walk back around, basically putting a double coat on it. Everything's coming off real well. There's some tough areas like this where the lichen is real heavy, but uh, it's going very well. Let's take a look at the, uh, I'm letting it dwell a little right now. There's our water. One bucket. So one bucket of SH. Yeah. Yeah, we use one bucket of SH, full strength SH, and not even half the tank of water to apply chem on this trailer twice. So, just kind of to go off of, so you can go, this is an eight gallon a minute machine, so that might help you get an idea if you have to bring water to a job site, if you can realistically get it done. Um, but keep in mind, we gotta rinse real thoroughly and stuff. We're gonna have to apply more chem to these tough spots. Actually, we might grab the pump up sprayer and just grab full strength or half and half SH and apply it straight on there for the lichen so it can die die off a little quicker. Other than that, this is pretty much done. These little porch tops cleaned up really nice. They were nasty and they're bright white. They're gonna be really happy about that. Uh, the shed cleaned up nice. I'm gonna hit that shed. I forgot to hit that wall of the shed. Yeah, this cleaned up great. I'm happy with it. So, we uh, had a scare, didn't we, Chris? We had a scare when we first got here. The uh, downstream injector wasn't pulling chem. And I'm like, waiting for it and spraying, waiting for it to pull. And uh, a little tip or trick. And so it was a brand new injector we put on there too. And it's actually for a four gallon a minute machine, which means this downstream injector pulls a lot more chem than the eight gallon a minute one which is nice because of the winter, you know, we get more chem on there than we normally would, so it's helping. But uh, it wouldn't open up, it was just pulling water. So I got the, I got a wrench and I tapped it a few times and you heard it change, you heard something change. So something just got locked up in there in spring or whatever and it's pulling chem just fine now. So All right, I'm gonna get back to spraying some tough spots. We're gonna get a pump up sprayer and really nuke some hard areas and we'll be out of here in 30 minutes. How long was that? Like an hour tops, right? Yeah. Shit. It's good shit, man. So, it's all cleaned up. We used an entire tank. Try to remember, rinsing takes twice as much water as applying chem. So, I was kind of getting chem happy and we got all the way down to a half tank and then I had a half tank to rinse with. So really had to move fast with the rinsing and uh, Chris was walking around with me with a rag, kind of spot getting stuff. So, you know, we kind of rinsed the bulk of everything off, the trim, the siding, the windows, and then behind the shutters, some gunk would kind of run and Chris would wipe that runoff off rather than wasting a whole bunch of water, rinsing behind the shutters, getting every last piece of dirt off. So, I mean, the trim didn't come out as great as I wanted, but it's a million times better. Um, I mean, it's really shining. You could literally, couldn't you? You could like 
and you're spraying, just watch it. Oh yeah, just watch the dirt just fly it, off. It was like literally changing colors. So this was, I think this was way dirtier than they thought it was. So I think they're gonna be pretty happy with it. I'd be pretty happy with mine. Yeah. Cool, man. We're out of here. Even their little. Look brand new. Yeah, I got that one too. Oh yeah. But yeah, man. Just so bring your own water. It's a double wide, it was super dirty. We got it done in an hour. So now that like, gots me thinking like, we should mark it like super hard. I mean, we could even do like 125 bucks a trailer or something and just get like 10 of them in a day. <laughs> not maybe not 10, but you know what I mean? Like at least five, shit. <clears throat> Good shit, man. It feels good getting out and working, you know? Yeah. Well, not too bad. Hell yeah.